Hey there, what are you doing with your life? This is D.E.D., your friendly neighborhood vegan. I'm here to speak to you about the assault and battling judging system that I've created with the help of Iceman and Shamrock. It's been stamped by Absurd and crafted with the help of the great Iron Sheik, aka the creator of the Zero. We're doing this to stop all the crybabies, pretty much. So uh, if you have a problem with the judgment, you can go to the card. And, um, you know, it's, it's doing well so far. We did it in a, the last event, kind of uh, preliminary, and we did some crafting and some changing, and it's, it's looking really good now. So let's get to it. These battles are going to be judged round by round, three rounds. Whichever battler wins the most rounds, wins the battle. We can go to overtime. Judges can vote for overtime only if the score between the battlers is three or less. Now, if a judge scored somebody that won by four or more, then they already have a winner. You know what I mean? Uh, you can't just vote for overtime because you want to see it. Um, we're trying to find winners here in these battles. So that's what we're doing. Let's get down to the factors that we're judging on. This is important. Battlers, listen up. One of the things that we're judging on is your delivery. That means your whole style and pace, your confidence. Your clarity, are we understanding what you're saying? If we don't understand what you're saying, you're going to lose delivery points. If you're kind of mumbling, if you're losing your breath, you lose points on delivery. Now, if you're confident and you're calm and collected, or you're hyped and people can understand you even though you're yelling, your delivery will get good points. That counts. Another thing we're judging on, punches. Not in a literal sense, your punch lines quantity and quality so you gotta have some punch lines if you have a lot of them it's, it's all good as long as they're good you can have a million crappy punch lines you still won't get a good score so quantity and quality on those make sure you're not recycling punch lines or they're not predictable um, or else you won't really get a good score lastly your creativity it's very important this battle game is extremely oversaturated there's lots of copycats we're not gonna reward them so, um, make sure you have your own style. You're not doing something that you saw on a DVD or on the internet in 2007. Make sure you're using rhyme schemes that are not elementary. You know what I mean? If it sounds tired, if you're doing that same old compound multi-crap, you won't get good points. You know what I'm saying? If you are biting, you lose points. For reals. So, if judges have heard something before, you will get docked points. Those are the three factors. We've gone through the whole system. I want to send shout outs to everybody watching these assault and battling battles. Anybody that wants to buy beats from me, I send a shout out to you. Let's go ahead and put the little caption right there. <clears throat> MyBeatShop.com slash VXDEDXV. That's me. And this beat you're hearing in the background right now is one of mine, of course. Any suggestions, any questions, any concerns about the system, not about your life, I can't really help you on that. Unless you want to follow me on Twitter, that's Twitter slash VXDEDXB. Pow pow, shameless plug. Hit me up on my email. Boop. There it is right there, you can read. And anybody that wants to help with judging is very appreciated. Come through FTK on the 21st for Assault and Battling versus everybody, I guess. The jungles, some jungle cats will be there. Um, some bar exam dudes will be there, assault and battlings regulars will be there, I will be there, y your mom might be there, I don't know. It's going to be a lot of fun man. Like I said, you have the contacts, you have the info, you have the contact info. This is D.E.D. for Assault and Battling signing off. Peace.